conclusion, I humbly accept this award for subduing the insidious light-eating Zagroot against near-impossible odds. How's that sound? Quark, doesn't accepting an award for something you didn't do make you feel the slightest bit deceitful? It depends. Does deceitful mean impressive? Heroic? Oh, inspiring Fine, I don't care what it means. We're talking about a light-eating Zagroot here. You know what this will do for my approval rating? I never even heard of an Intergalactic Tool of Justice Award. Who did you say invited you? I don't know. The guy was all cloak and dagger on the phone. But I'm sure the whole thing's on the up and up. Look at him. Peacefully slumbering in the warm embrace of cryosleep. I don't know about this. Maybe we should call Kronk and Zephyr. Oh, Ratchet. So young, so unused to the spoils of do-goodery. Don't worry. When you're a hero, you'll understand. House lights? Well, hello, Mr. President! So kind of you to accept my invitation. Dr. Nefarious. I was wondering when you'd be showing up. Is that your new space station? Looks a little smaller than the last one. Oh, you're hysterical. Let's see you crack jokes from inside the digestive tract of a Sagroot! Oh, goody. I get to reanimate something. <laughs> I think it's time to tend to my resignation. Stop the Zagroot before he destroys the city. <laughs> this one's mine. <laughs> Unhand the Aphelion right this instant. I'm Pepper Fairbanks. And we're coming to you live from Luminopolis, where Dr. Nefarious has just released a light-eating Zagroot upon the city. The latest attack from the diabolical doctor couldn't have come at a worse time. Currently, the entire Polaris Defense Force is off on a field trip to the single and hating its speed dating convention in Meridian City. Well, let's hope they find love, Pepper. And now, back to the Maulings. Life for <laughs> 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 